Hey Psych2Goers, welcome back to our channel. Your ongoing love and support has helped us make psychology and mental health more accessible to everyone. And we wanna thank you for that. So thank you. Now, let's continue. Have you ever been in a manipulative relationship before? With a friend, partner, or family member? Manipulative people can come in all shapes and sizes. They're good at manipulating their environment and the people in it to ensure that they get their way. They use emotionally abusive behavior to keep you in line and complacent so they can use you for their own benefit. So here are six signs of a manipulative person to watch out for. Number one, they don't acknowledge your thoughts and opinions. A manipulative person will have trouble acknowledging your differing perspectives and opinions. They don't put much importance on what your thoughts are and instead of asking after you, they will try to bend you to their will. They make you feel guilty and second guess your thoughts and feelings in order to have control over you by turning your behavior into what they need it to be. Ultimately, all situations and relationships are about them. What you think, feel, and want doesn't really matter to them. Two, they're good at guilt tripping you. Have you ever been blamed for something you know you didn't do? Or had your good intentions sullied by a manipulator in your life? A manipulative person wants to make you feel guilty about the decisions you make, your intentions, or any kind of stand you might try to take against them. They'll poke holes in your sound, logical arguments and make you question yourself. They point the finger back at you and will gaslight you to keep you submissive to them. Number three, they don't take responsibility for their own behavior. A manipulator avoids taking responsibility for their own behavior by blaming others for causing it. While they understand what responsibility is, they see nothing wrong with refusing to take responsibility for their actions, even while making you take responsibility for yours. They may even try to get you to take responsibility for satisfying their needs, leaving you no time to fulfill your own individual needs. Number four, they turn friends to enemies. Do you feel that this person talks about you behind your back or do they talk badly of others to you? A manipulator is a master at triangulation where they create scenarios and dynamics that allow for intrigue, rivalry, and jealousy and encourage disharmony between others. They'll sow the chaos between their friends, family members, and other people in their lives. Number five, they play the victim. Another manipulative tactic to help draw you in is to play the victim card. If they need special attention, you are more likely to feel empathetic towards them and this implores you to help them out. Once you feel sorry for them, it's easier for them to manipulate you into getting what they want. And number six, they routinely provoke arguments and disagreements between the two of you. When a manipulator stirs up an argument with you, they can push you into saying things you don't mean or maybe wouldn't have said in the first place. They wind up trapping you this way by making you feel guilty for what you said and then forcing you to sympathize and accept their own feelings. It's just another tactic to get you to distrust yourself and break you down so they can further take advantage of you. Did this video help you recognize some signs of manipulation? Do you think there are any other signs that we missed? Let us know in the comments below. Please like and share this video if it helped you and you think it could help someone else too. The studies and references used are listed in the description below. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and notification bell icon for more Psych2Go videos. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you next time.